black hoodie, I'm back cooking these goodies. Look at these views from cooking these foods. Yeah. Hey yo, what up world? What's good with y'all? Today we are dealing with something other than myself that is criminally underrated and slept on. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is Dairy Queen. Dairy Queen's food actually pops and I'm ready to get into it. So I got it all wrapped up here. We'll get it unveiled and get into some pails and just, you know, have a good old eating time. Okay, meet me when the food's out. Okay, so I lied. I'm going to unwrap it with you. So in here we have chicken tenders. I'm gonna get them out and then we'll get to the rest just because this box is obnoxious and taking up much too much room. Chicken tendies. Hello, beautiful. I have a poutine here and it looks bang, bang, boom. I cannot lie. Smells proper too, that nice brown gravy. And then this brings me to the main event, which I'm very excited for is this burger and oh my lord it is looking so good holy crap that's what i'm saying all right gang's all here got the poutine looking fantastic nice beef gravy on there we got this banger of a burger called the flamethrower tell me that isn't a tempstress in the night coming at you with all of her charm potions and secrets these are the chicken tenders and i gotta tell you dq makes a fine chicken tender i cannot lie okay so before we do anything more we must <laughs> pour okay i forwent the drink with the combo they gave me aquafina but you know i aquafina doctor fienda you know what i mean the papa the doctor Coming to save lives. Restart my heart. Oh, and put the fizz on it. That almost was Mount Vesuvius level fizz. Okay. Could be Yellowstone. Canada is going to explode in the near future and everyone's going to die. Is it even in Canada? I don't think so. It's in America. My bad. Yellowstone National Park. I don't know. I'm not a geography expert or major in fact geography was my third period in high school and i spent a lot of that time meeting my friend in the bathroom for bathroom chills okay that's a high school memory we'll talk about that maybe in this video we'll also talk about this just high school stuff okay yeah let's just do that because this burger reminds me of high school my best friend from high school so we must Initiate. Rejazz it up. And then get to getting. So I got some honey must. Cause it's because it is a must to have honey must with your tenderonies. And y'all know. A man brings his ranch to every party. Also, I'm going to go ahead and deface my poutine with a whole bunch of ketchup. Because why? Because the vinegar cuts through the fat of the cheese and the gravy. Okay? So, we go. And while it's hot, I got to get the the poutine while she's hot not as hot as I imagined or like would like it to be but we'll deal with it okay guys there you go a Canadian treat for you to enjoy Okay. Okay. It's an interesting gravy. Very interesting gravy. Very beef. Which I like. 
I look at, I like a good salty beef gravy. I just wish my only concern here is I wish the gravy would have been more evenly distributed and kind of down throughout the whole fries. A lot of them at the bottom are a little bit dry. Still very good though. Mm -hmm. A chicken strip for good measure. We give you a strip dip cam. Mm. Strip, dip, and new drip, by the way. Got myself a new Tommy beanie. And a Bruce Lee flex. All right. Let's bite this burger because it is looking amazing. This is a flamethrower burger. So it's got like flamethrower sauce on it. It's got bacon, some sort of white cheese, an amazing bun, two patties, and there might even be jalapenos on here. I'm not entirely sure. sure. We're about to find out. I'll take a burger. So I'll say a few things about this right off the rip. That right there is heartburn in a bun. That sauce has kick and heat to it. Also, Dairy Queen burgers. Dairy Queen. Yeah, Dairy Queen. Burgers remind me a lot of Burger King burgers. They have that similar flame grilled type taste. And third is, I haven't had Dairy Queen probably in like the food in like 10 years. I remember when the flamethrower first came out, me and my best buddy, when we got our licenses, driver's licenses, we used to go get stoned and get flamethrowers religiously. Same dude I used to have Big Mac eating comps, comps with. I think I've said this before, but him and I used to get stoned and go to McDonald's and order like three, four Big Macs. Sit out in the parking lot and see who could crush the most. Productive teen years. And we were actually inspired do that by the movie Super Size Me, which was supposed to make you not want to eat fast food. But instead, we ended up idolizing the dude who ate Big Macs every day. Gorski or whatever his last name was. Matt Gorski or something like that. I can't remember his name. He looked like John Lennon. 
and he wasn't a god to us. He was our idol. We're like, oh, I want to eat Big Macs every day. And not only do I want to eat Big Macs, I want to eat like many Big Macs. That's a bite right there. Mm -hmm. Obviously, I'm going to like it with the ranch. Needs the ranch to cool it down. That flamethrower sauce is actually no joke. Like I can tell. I'm getting sweaty and red already. It's happening. Light up the eyes, boys. Light up the eyes. But yeah, about history class, me and this one buddy. Because it was after lunch. We used to like schedule what we used to call like BC. We would say, I'd be like, meet me in BC at 2.15. And BC was bathroom chill. So you go to class, be in there for a bit. And then we would both at a certain time where we're supposed to meet, just like ask to leave to go to the bathroom. And then we'd go chill in the bathroom for like 20 to 25 minutes. I can't, we can't be the only ones. I'm sure other people in high school had to do that. Teachers always used to come, always used to come in and be like, get back to class. This flamethrower sauce is no joke. I forgot. That's like difficult to keep eating. Holy shit, man, that flamethrower sauce is legitimately playing with my emotions right now. It is not nice. Good burger, but spicy. Too spicy for me. Something about eating hot stuff too it makes you like full way faster. I'm tapped out. I know it's weak because I have one chicken finger left, but I just like, I feel like I need to stop. But yo, DQ is actually legit good. I always forget. I always forget about you, my queen. Okay, till the next one. Eat good, live well. Stay true.